All right, different savers today. And of course, I'm starting at the jewelry. I was at the counter, but it was too crowded. So I decided to come over here and see what was on the little rack. So... What is this? Oh, this is a Betsy Johnson piece. It does have a little bit of wear, but I really like that. That'll be the first thing going in the cart. Okay, that's a good find. All right, let me take a look at the other side. All right, not seeing much over here. Let me hop on over to the other rack. All right, so now we're at the necklaces. Let's go, see. No markings on that one. It is so crowded. <laughs> okay, let me maneuver myself. We're gonna put it in. We're gonna put it in. This is kind of cool. This looks like um, like an aura quartz, but it's not. Okay. Now the cool thing about jewelry is that a lot of times you can feel it and if it feels like really flimsy then usually you know it's not a quality piece and a lot of these feel kind of flimsy to me but that's not always the case. Ooh, now this is different looking. It's not missing any stones. It's $3.99. It does have a tag that I'm trying to see. Hmm, I like that. So I'm going to put this in the cart. Okay, let's see what else. This looks like, oh no. I have another similar necklace like this, but mine is a lapis lazuli, and I thought that's what that one was. Okay. All right, not seeing much else. Finally made it over to the hard goods. And this is what the end cap is looking like. Been seeing a lot of bells. <laughs> a lot of bells. Okay. I have a good feeling that I'm going to find something good here. I just... I just do. I have a really good feeling. This is a very cool candle holder and it looks vintage. It's got something yucky in it, but it is $2.99. Something about that I like. I wish there were a pair of these, but I only see the one. Oh, I was gonna put that in the cart, but I see it's got a massive chip on it. Oh well, so much for that. Okay. The nice thing about this savers is that they don't have the music blasting. I mean, 
you know, you can definitely hear it, but it's not horrendously loud like the other savers I normally go to. Okay. Lots of candles, lots of candles. What is this one? Oh, this is Veluspa. I love the Veluspa candles. Oops. <laughs> and looks like somebody made this. Okay, and it looks like they're putting out new stock. So that's really good. Now, I'm really excited to be shopping today because my son is spending the weekend at my mom's house, so I have <laughs> I have all day and all night to shop as long as I want to. Usually, I'm shopping, you know, while he's in school, so I'm on a, a, a you know, I have limited amount a limited amount of time but today I don't so that is really exciting okay looks like we're getting to the end of this shelf let me swing on over to the other side all right so now we're looking at the wood section look at this cute little box $8.99 Made in China. This looks like a crafter's piece, I think. Ooh, what's in here? Oh, that's a um, silverware box. <laughs> the Wicked Witch. Okay. Usually I don't find anything in the uh, wood section. But since I have the time to look, I may as well. What is this? Is this an instrument? I don't know. Now this is pretty. I have sold um, wood artwork carvings like this, uh, but the price here, $9.99, is a bit much, even with my coupon. So that's too bad, because this is really well done. Okay. Let's keep it moving. Okay, I'm not seeing too much right now, but you know, we're just getting started, just getting started. Okay, I don't see anything here. <laughs> I don't see anything here, so let me, let me look at the baggies, because that is what's next. Okay. I don't know what these are. They look like some type of stamps or something. <laughs> this little grocery cart is something my son would like. All right. Um, what is this? There's something in there. It looks like an looks like an egg or something. I don't know what that is. I don't know, I just, I'm expecting something to jump out at me. So far, so far it hasn't happened yet. Look at this, this is a little Valentine's Day bear and a little owl in there. Okay, 
um, I'm not seeing too much over here. So I think I'm going to head back on over to the shelves. All right, so we've made it to the planners, notebooks, school supplies. Uh, let's take a look at what this is. Okay. Ooh, I like these. Now, if you see these um, ARC discs or Happy Planner discs, uh, if, if you can find them in good condition, uh, I usually sell a lot, a lot of those. Hmm, but I've never seen one like this before. Okay. This is a planner. Okay. Lots of uh, hole punchers and staplers and tape dispensers. Photo albums, notebooks, picture frames. <laughs> Hmm. Now this is a good reminder. Those who in, indulge, bulge. Uh-oh, I don't know if you guys heard that. Sounds like somebody just broke something. That's kind of pretty. Okay. All right, not seeing too much here. Let's flip on over to the other side. Oh my gosh, look at these frogs. They're so cute. Now these look like they are definitely outdoor for the garden. <laughs> so you have hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil back there. So cute. But here in Las Vegas, we don't really have a need for the garden decor. I like that vase. <laughs> but those frogs are fun. All right, let's keep it moving and see, see what else we can find. Here's another little garden uh, decor. This looks like a, a gnome or something or an elf with a little bunny. Okay, I'm not seeing too much over here. Now I just noticed this canister. It says $3.99, but it's really got a lot of damage and it looks like it's been repaired. But that's a good price. Okay. All right, I'm not seeing too much else over here. We've got all these baskets. These are really nice. But I'm not really looking for baskets today. All right, I do see something interesting. Look at this. Oh man, it's got a big crack on the bottom. That's why this is still here. <clears throat> that looks like a Fenton piece. I love the color, but I'm very disappointed <laughs> that it has a big crack. Oh well. All right, ooh, this is an interesting piece of glass. This is an ashtray. It looks vintage. It says $9.99. I don't think, okay, that's not a crack. I love this. Uh, I don't love the price, but it will be $8 with my coupon. 
And because this is so unique, I'm definitely going to throw that in the cart. Very cool. Okay. Now this also caught my eye. Some type of... What are these called? Are these called compotes? Pedestal? Pedestal dishes or something like that? All right, there's no marking on it. But I really like that. Ooh, what is this? Oh, too bad it's got a chip. And then this is catching my eye. Oh, never mind. It's a target threshold. Then something else caught my eye. like plastic. I thought this was a, um, what is it called? Alabaster or something like that. But then look at this. This looks like a piece of, um, what do they call it? Like agate, I want to say. But I, not really agate, but I do like it. It does have a little bit of damage on the corners, but for $2.50, I think we'll put that in the cart. Okay. This is Pyrex. I'm not sure of the pattern on this one. And I know this is supposed to have a lid. So all you Pyrex, <clears throat> Pyrex people can tell me what this pattern is. And if I should have grabbed it. I love the colors on this. Okay, let's keep moving on down. Ooh, what is this? That's really pretty. This looks like it's something from, um, I want to say Portugal, but I'm not sure. Okay. All right. I'm going to keep on looking. Hopefully I find something good to share. Oh, look, here's a little piece of milk glass. I kind of like that. $4.49. And. Ooh, look at this. Now, this is some type of an art glass piece. It's only $3.49. Some of the pricing here is crazy because it seems like things that should be more are not. <laughs> And then things that should be cheap or not. Okay, I do like this. Although, I don't know if that's flash painted on there or if that's just something stuck on there. And I think I'm going to leave it just because I think it's going to be a lot to ship. But that's a very interesting piece. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and swing on over to the other side and see if we find anything else. Okay guys, here is a cart update. You know, I was having second thoughts about this glass <laughs> platter dish, whatever it is. So I went back and threw it in my cart just to think about it some more. I found these really pretty. It's like a milky, milky glass kind of plate. It's $4.99 for two plus 20% off. I don't know who makes these, but I think I remember seeing Yvonne from Thrifty Rich talk about these plates. 
So I'm going to see if I can do some research on these and um, I might pick those up. And then I found these really cute poodle dishes. They are by Glidden, Glidden Pottery. And I looked them up and the comps look really, really good. So this is $3.99 for four. And uh, of course, then I'll get my 20% off. So I think that's going to be a really good deal. And there's four of them there. So that is an update on what the card is looking like. Um, I was trying to film on the shelves, but it got really crowded and I didn't want to film, you know, with a bunch of people around. But anyways, uh, let me go back and see what I can find. All right, so I think I'm pretty much done here. I just wanted to do a quick look through the purse section and see if there was anything over here <laughs> that I need to throw in my cart. Uh, I'm not seeing anything that really grabs my attention. This is kind of fun. Oh, that's a Betsy Johnson bag. And it is $11.99. Oops, sorry, I don't know if I, <laughs> if I had you guys in frame. It's a nylon bag, but it does have a lot of wear. Okay. Look at these emoji. Okay, let's see if there's anything else that jumps out at us. I really like this Savers. This Savers is much more thoroughly stocked than mine. Or I should say the one I usually go to. Um, look at this. I love Lucy purse. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, I'm not seeing too much, but you know, it could never hurt to check. I think that's like a ticket holder or something. Okay, so here's the final look at my cart. I did find this Yo Gabba Gabba plush. My son used to love watching this when he was little. So I picked that up. I did run some comps and they do sell for pretty good money. Uh, the rest of the stuff I did show you, uh, the only other thing different was I found these uh, recycled tumblers, recycled, recycled glass tumblers. And I only found three. The price on here says for four, but I couldn't find the fourth one. So I found three, so I'm gonna ask up front, you know, what if you know what the price is. I also found this grape milk glass dish, which I think I'm gonna put back because I saw some that were sold on eBay and they just they just don't bring very much and um, so I'm gonna put these back. But everything else I am gonna grab, the jewelry, the dishes there, the plush. I think I am going to get this glass platter here, <sighs> but I don't know. Now I'm having second thoughts. I do like this um, little agate tray or whatever, and it's only $2.50, so. But anyway, yeah, <laughs> that's what the card's looking like. I'm going to wrap up here, and then I'm going to go somewhere else. Like I said, I think I'm going to go to the Salvation Army. All right, everyone, I'll see you when I get there.